Hey all here OS Reviews. About two years ago we checked out a really cool table lamp from Aki called the Aura and I've been using it on my desk. You guys may have seen it in our videos quite a few times. It's just the circular light which looks really modern and has colors that can glow and flash. Well today we're taking a look at another version which is obviously bigger and it has all of these circles stacked on top of one another. Honestly, I consider it to be part of the same family or inspired by that similar design, but now again, just has more of these lights. So instead of being a desk lamp, this is now a room light. It's a freestanding lamp. Now all of these lights that you see there with this kind of asymmetrical shape has been fixed in this particular variant. So these actually aren't things that you have to attach. They're also not really modular or you can move them around. Height here will come up a little bit taller than most kitchen counters, but this is not going to be maybe quite as tall as you would think looking at just the images alone. 43.3 inches in terms of the height. So anyways, this is what it looks like in a few other kind of scenarios. Again, very modern looking, and it retails for around 160 bucks. Sometimes goes on sale for even less, so a little expensive for just a lamp, but you're paying a bit more for that interesting design. And considering that the single Aki ring light was around 60 bucks, at least they're not charging six times the price. So anyways, again, 358 different light effects to try out, controlled using a remote. So this one does not connect using a smartphone app. It doesn't have Wi-Fi or Bluetooth. So that's one thing to keep in mind. LEDs, which are pretty energy efficient. Lumens, you're talking about uh, a variety here from 3,834 to 4,260, depending on the color that you're selecting. Bright enough for what it is. Now, this particular lamp, I got it from Lamp Depot and they also sell a variety of other unique interesting artistic looking lamps so if you don't like this particular design i also saw other ones which are in the shape of a person's head or visage it might not be for everyone but at the very least definitely eye-catching especially if you're looking into just unique cool led lights so as aforementioned there's basically no installation required it just comes with that base and then all the lights which are already stuck onto place and it's weighted using aluminum and has a foam padding at the bottom so it won't really slide around even if you put it onto a hardwood surface there is a safety switch on the side, so once you plug it into the wall, you can also press on that to manually turn it on. It's all capacitive and touch sensitive. It takes just AAA battery, and you are able to use this color wheel to go through the RGB different colors or in the rainbow mode, as well as some other presets. You can also change the brightness, the speed of the transition effects. So if we turn it on right now, it will have a memory function, so it remembers the last mode that it was on before you turned it off. But let's try also going into the auto mode, which is personal one of my favorites and it's in this rainbow effect that slowly glistens and changes between all the colors just looks really beautiful almost an aura gentle effect everything is flashing and changing and then it goes through different effects as well so it's not just that one static one it will change its animations now it's in this kind of stacking mode where it's just going in these spirals uh, before it just resets Arguably, it's a little bit easier to see what's happening if you put it against a wall, something flat, or a white color in the background, it becomes even more obvious, creating this almost halo effect as it's shining behind it, which is pretty cool. So right now I'm toggling the brightness level. This is actually the kind of minimum as I'm going down further and further. This is as dim as it possibly gets, turning it back up and it will then go into the kind of maximum brightness level. Let's try changing the speed. So right now it's in this very fast kind of oscillation. And if I want to kind of slow down these circles, which are just spinning hectically, I can also make it slower and slower until all of these transitions might eventually try and pause a bit more choppy as it's going through LED and LED and creating these effects. Or of course you can speed it up and just make it a lot faster in terms of its movement um, as it's going along there. So that's up to your preference. And so all of these are pretty easy to control. You can also change the color kind of gradient as well yourself uh, if you want to manually go through some of the transitions. So this is kind of a aura color, blue and purple. Another one here is more of a traditional rainbow color with reds and we have another one here more with greens as well here's one with a single color but also looks really cool here's just a red really dramatic another one here which is green and another one here which is purple just going through individual shades now with a similar snake-like twisting pattern uh, now we have it slowly kind of falling down the rings and uh, the patterns just keep on coming. So if I don't particularly like these colorful breathing and RGB rainbow effects, I can also choose to have it at a static single color instead of going through all these presets one at a time. I can choose the one that I like the most uh, just by simply 
using the color wheel on the middle section of the remote. So let's say I want to switch into just red. I can tap on that there, um, or a more pinkish shade, or I can go over to a more green color. Let's try yellow, as well as purple. So all of these can be selected pretty easily with this dial, almost like a touch wheel of an iPod back in the day, and you can cycle through it pretty responsively. Um, if anything though, the individual shades in between can still be at times a little bit hard to delineate because it's not as precise as having a single button that you press that uh, will trigger the same color. You have to kind of find that position in the wheel. A few ending remarks here would be it does lack something like a timer function, although not many other lamps I've seen have that. But uh, if you want to say have it turn off after X minutes, uh, that's something that you have to use, let's say a smart plug to control at the moment. So here's just a closer look at it kind of one at a time and the wheels together, but again, once you zoom out, it creates that really dazzling effect. So that is more or less it as far as our hands-on review of this uh, stacked ring light. It definitely adds a modern touch and splash of colors to any room, or again, you can leave it onto a white light if you prefer something that is just a bit more traditional. Serves a lot of scenarios, whether it's for mood lighting, whether it's for even a party, ambience, uh, or just a natural glow. So you can check out more details if you're looking for just a bit more of a unique light, uh, as well as other interesting designs in general in the links below. For now, that's been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews.